Hello everybody, Ben back here at Happy Hannon Studios, right here live in Manitowoc, Wisconsin. We're talking about Skater Mania live from Green Bay, Wisconsin, or Ashwaubenon, Wisconsin, the Green Bay Sports Organization. Uh, this was an amazing Now That's Wrestling event. We're talking about a match-by-match -match review. Next up was Roy Cooper versus Preston Palmer. Now, in Now They Are on opposite side, Best Friends Club versus the McClure family. However, outside of here, they are a tag team, Gen Z, one of the most up-and-coming tag teams there is out there in the Midwest today. So it was funny, to begin the match, Preston tried to make a connection with his Gen Z mate by doing their thing, uh, which you all know I'm not Gen Z, so I'm not going to try to do it. Roy was having none of it, none of it, none of it. He was ready to go. Um, this was a spectacular match. Uh, you know, the two know each other so well. They're, they're evenly matched. Uh, it was reverse after reverse after move after move after reverse after reverse. It was spectacular. Spectacular. Roy is really one of my favorites of... The Midwest. Preston, absolutely the same. I have to say, this was the first time I truly believed Preston as a good guy. He really came out as the good guy and took got quite the pop. Um, I feel like without the others weighing him down, him just being good by himself was spectacular. And Roy, of course, as always, sold that bad guy role. Not the funny bad guy like Gen Z, but the uh, tough, I'm going to kick your ass bad guy like the McClure family, Roy. Like I said, this was back and forth with counter moves. Uh, Roy did his best Shane McMahon impression, uh, leaping across the ring, putting both his feet square into Preston, who was hanging upside down um, from the turnbuckle. I would love to see these two go at it again. Roy did win with some interference from Porny. More to come in a separate video on that developing situation in an editorial because Ben from Happy Hand and Studio has some things to say about what, how he feels about that situation. Still in all, I did give the match a 9 out of 10. Uh, definitely was a just... A spectacular match. And again, I would love to see those two get a rematch. So keep it up, you two. Absolutely spot on, flawless match. Would have been a 10 out of 10 if Porny would have kept his big nose out of the match. More to come. Next up, we had another title match of Kaiser, the Mid Valley champ, versus Adam Christopher. Adam Christopher won the opportunity to face Kaiser at the last show. However, I think anybody who knows knew that Craig Covenant was going to join the match at some point because of the one sweet medallion, or as I like to call it, the medallion of doom. So after Adam and uh, Kaiser beat the holy heck out of each other, here comes Craig, here comes Craig, right down to the ring. Brought his medallion, gave it to Wade, and there he went. He jumped in and started kicking all those people's butts. And guess what happened? Craig won the Mid-Valley Championship. So in, so in fact, he did. Craig is now the new champ. McClure seemed absolutely disgusted with Kaiser after the match. Uh, I think it's funny. McClure is absolutely the type that what have you done for me lately type of guy. Uh, so, uh, Craig Covenant, congratulations. You are the new Mid-Valley Wrestling Champion. We'll see who your next opponent is. Potentially... Uh, somebody else from the McClure family trying to win it back. 
We're going to cut this video a little short. We've got a couple more matches to talk about. I want to do those in a separate video to give them the time they deserve. Hope you're enjoying my videos. If you are, make sure you're liking, subscribing, all that good stuff. If I see you, if I don't see you again today, good morning, good afternoon, good night.